I just, you know, it's pretty overwhelming at first because there's so many guitars out there and there's so many sounds and trying yeah. to develop your sound. Because it is, it's, it's intimidating when you're first learning to play, going sure. into a guitar store. You're expected to play something amazing you know, right. as you sit down with a guitar or else it's, it's lame. So. <laughs> GuitarBizarre.com Hey everybody, it's Ben Schneider here at the Guitar Bazaar. I'm here with Lee from the band Castle Black. Lee is the lead guitar player and songwriter from Castle Black. And we're here with Ranger, who is the mascot of the band. Aww, he's so handsome. Uh, I wanted to talk to Lee for a little while about her influences and her gear, and then she's going to demo some guitars for us today. How are you? Good, how are you? Terrific. Uh, I understand that you've been playing for about eight years, is that right? Yes. When you started out playing guitar, how did you go about looking for instruments and purchasing your gear? I initially was taking lessons, so I developed a good relationship with my teacher, mm -hmm. who I really, really just trusted initially because I had no one else to kind of trust in that realm. So I went on his recommendations when I got my first acoustic, and then a year in I wanted to play electric, and w again went on my teacher's recommendations as well as other friends who I knew who played guitar. Sure. So I did a little bit of research online and also thought about guitar players I liked, just to kind of think about what people had. And did you go into shops and try things out? Not so much um, in the beginning. I mean, I did when I made the purchase, but I was with a friend, uh, because it is. It's, it's intimidating when you're first learning to play, going sure. into a guitar store. A lot of gunslingers and uh, yeah, shootouts. You're expected to play something amazing you know, right. as you sit down with a guitar or else it's, it's lame. So I'm, there's I'm just a lot of pressure. I'm very familiar with that pressure. <laughs> so I brought a friend and we tried out some guitars and went from there. Very cool. Who are your influences? I really admire Jack White. Uh, his playing, I mean everything, his songwriting. He has so many different projects um, and just his, you know, his Roots in the blues, I think, really, really influenced me. Um, sure. I also like Johnny Greenwood from Radiohead. Radiohead, sure. Yeah, he's just so creative, so experimental. Lee Ronaldo from Sonic Youth, again, completely creative, cutting edge guitarist. And very different players you're naming. I mean, these people come come at the instrument from some different directions. Yeah. Very yeah. cool. Jamie Hintz from The Kills as well. He's an amazing, just the creativity and the way he plays is just something that always resonated as well. Yeah, right on. Um, do you play through any pedals? I do. Yes, I have. I primarily use an OCD. I use. Uh, I have a muff pedal. Um, I have an octave pedal mm -hmm. and a good line six delay, and I use a chorus pedal pretty regularly. Is that about the order that they're in in the chain? Um, comes into the comes into the octave pedal, goes to the muff OCD chorus. Wraps around to the delay, and then goes to the boost. Life is short. Play your ass off. TheGuitarBizarre.com